2023 is kind of an amazing year in the media business because we have something new on the horizon. We have something capable of doing this, which is writing white papers, for example, um, just straight at the click of a button. This is called ChatGPT. I'm sure lots of you have used it. Some of you probably understand generative AI really well. Um, it's capable of producing incredible imagery like this or like this guy or like this. This is a, an adrenaline shot to human creativity. Um, these are virtual humans. These are virtual humans. These are people just created synthetically by AI. This is going back in history. This is Marilyn Monroe and John Kennedy, um, a guy doing a selfie at the Hall of Troy, 1920s Burning Man. The creativity just goes on and on and on. And this is media in the age of AI. And it's a really fascinating time. Why are these tools being created? And what are we going to do with them? And it's really a, just a critical moment in the history of media. So back in the 15th century, we had the invention of the printing press. Then into the 19th century, you had the photograph, then the moving image. And then into the 20th century, radio, TV, then the internet. I think we're at a moment like that with generative AI. If anyone's in any doubts, just as I record this, OpenAI, the company behind JetTPT, has just been valued at $29 billion. Uh, venture capital investment has gone up by 400% in this space. Google's on red alert to work out how to include generative AI in its own products. This is Mark Andreessen, the, the very famous venture capitalist. We are entering an AI-powered golden age of writing art, music, software, and science. It's going to be glorious, world historical. I've written a book about this. Um, if you look at where the media is now, it's not the old media companies that we knew in the 1990s that actually control the media we have now. It's the big tech companies, the Apples, the Microsofts, the Googles, the Meta, Facebooks. And we're going to be looking through the prism of that at four key phases in media creation. We're looking at development, production, distribution, and monetization. We're going to be looking at that model across all the different segments of the media. We're going to get into what's creativity? How, how do you create creativity? How do you make it happen? Something that will give you um, useful learnings well beyond just the media. Um, so there's no business unlike show business in some ways. So if we can figure out how to, how to manufacture creativity, we'll be in a great position, whether we're in the beauty business or the fashion business or any other business. And the funny thing about creativity is no one really knows about creativity. No one knows where great songs come from, as Chris Marty from Coldplay sang. So um, we have um, a huge field of opportunity here. My favorite subject, 